Hey guys, my name is Drizuka, and today I'm going to be unboxing and reviewing my San Diego Comic Con 2020 at Funko Pop haul. So let's do it. Alright guys, so as I said, today we are going to be taking a look at all of the San Diego Comic Con 2020 Funko Pops I got this year. So I'm actually really excited for this video. I've been waiting to open them for this video and they're finally all here and it's time to take a look at the San Diego Comic Con Funko Pops I got, so let's do it. And here is what we're going to be unboxing today, so let's go ahead and get right into it. So I have three pops, one in this box, one in this box, and one in this bag that I'm going to be taking a look at today. And then I also have three other San Diego Comic Con pops that I actually opened in the last video, so if you want to see those, be sure to check that one out. But anyways, let's go ahead and get right into this one. So let's start with the bag. So this one, instead of ordering online, I actually found it at my local Walmart and I decided to pick it up. And the reason I got it at my Walmart is because I did order it online, but Walmart ended up canceling my order. So without any further ado, let's go ahead and take it out of here. And it is the San Diego Comic-Con Dwight as Recyclops. It's actually a really nice pop up. It's actually a really nice pop, and if you watched my last Funko Pop video, you know that I'm going to be collecting The Office. So this is a good one to have for that series of pops that I want to collect. So yeah, there's the Dwight as Recyclops V2. It's a really nice pop. There it is. There is the Dwight Recyclops from San Diego Comic Con, and it has the shared sticker since I got it at Walmart instead of on the Funko Shop. Either way, it is a really great pop, so let's go ahead and take it out of the box. And let me actually move this bag out of the way. There we go. And here it is. Let's go ahead and pull it out of the box. And there he is out of the box. Now that is a really cool pop, actually. Wow. He looks pretty much exactly like he does in this part of the show, and it's actually really nice. I really like the helmet he's wearing with the little goggles. And he's also got these cool football pads on, so that's also a nice addition to the pop. Yeah, it looks pretty much exactly like the show, and it actually looks really good. I'm glad to have this one in my office collection, especially since it's an SDCC pop. But let's move on to the next one. All right, I'm going to go ahead and set Dwight right here, and let's go on to the next SDCC pop. And the next one we're going to be opening up is this box right here. So this is where it starts to get a little bit more exciting with these next two boxes. And I actually don't have any scissors so let me go grab some of those many unbearable hours later all right i got some scissors let's go ahead and open this box there we go i'm really excited for this one this is one of the main ones that i wanted and i actually ended up being able to get it anyways guys there we go let's go ahead and open this box up and get this pop out of here all right well the pop's actually in a another smaller box so let's go ahead and open this one all right here we go guys we're unfolding it it's happening here comes the pop Ooh! and there it is guys that looks so nice it is the alien remix kevin sdcc pop that is a really nice pop and it actually looks like the box is in pretty good condition there's a little ding on the corner right there but it's pretty much not even visible so that's fine yeah that is a really nice pop and the reason i wanted to get this one so bad is i'm actually planning on collecting the whole line of the alien remix pops just because they're a really cool colorful creative line and they're actually for pixar movies which is one of my favorite things ever and it actually has a really nice box too it has really good colors and on the back you can see the other remix pops that i'm planning on getting so yeah i'm really glad to have this pop let's go ahead and take it out of the box and see how it looks here let me get this out of the way there we go <laughs> and here is the alien as kevin remix pop out of box wow that is really cool actually that's a really nice pop it's super colorful which is cool and it actually I just noticed this. It kind of looks like Kevin from Up is actually eating the alien or swallowing him. That's pretty funny. Yeah, it's got a lot of really cool detail and colors and the feathers and the face and stuff. And I love the alien's expression, just like... So yeah, there's the Alien is Kevin Remix Funko Pop from SDCC. And as you can see right there, it has the shared sticker because I got it from Box Lunch and not the Funko Shop. But still, it's a really great pop. Alright, let's go ahead and put Kevin right here next to his Cyclops and move on to the last, but certainly not least, SCCC Funko Pop that I got this year. So here in the nice Funko Shop packaging is the last SDCC pop 
that we're going to be unboxing today. So let's go ahead and open this up. And even if we don't get the con sticker, it's a really great pop that I want for the collection. But you know, a con sticker would be great. So let's go ahead and open this up. All right, there we go. And there we go. And there we go. All right, guys, let's open this box up and get this Funko Pop out of here. Oh, and it came with cool green bubble wrap. So I'll have to pop that later. <laughs> and here, guys, is the last Funko Pop. Let's go ahead and take it out of its box. I'm going to do it without looking, and I'm going to show it to you guys first. All right, here we go. I can feel it coming out. There's the pop. I can't tell which side's the front. It may be upside down or something. I don't... Let me, let me see. Okay, yeah. So here, here is the pop. I don't know if I got a con sticker or a shared sticker. Either way, it's fine because I love the pop. It's the Michelangelo with surfboard. Let's go ahead and take a look. And we got the shared sticker. So I'm totally fine with getting the shared sticker. I know I didn't get a single con sticker out of any of my SDCC pops, but that's totally fine. The shared sticker is great and the pop is great too. But yeah, there is the Michelangelo with surfboard SDCC Funko Pop. Obviously, this pop is from Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, and it is a really cool pop. I don't know if you guys can really see it there, so let's go ahead and take it out of the box to see how good it looks. <laughs> and here is the Michelangelo with surfboard Funko Pop. It's actually a really nice pop. It has a lot of cool detail, and I love how the surfboard he's holding says Cowabunga on it and also has the Comic-Con logo. I think that's just a really cool addition to the pop. But yeah, this is just a really great one. I love the little pizzas on his shorts. And he's got the cool turtle shell, of course. And I don't know, it just looks like a really great pop and I really wanted this one. So I'm glad to have got it. Unfortunately, we didn't get the con sticker, but that's fine. I just wanted the pop mostly for my collection. I also like the little hand sign he's doing. It's funny because he only has the three fingers, so that's really cool. But yeah, that is overall just a really cool pop. I'm really glad to have it in my collection. But anyways, guys, these are the three San Diego Comic-Con 2020 Funko Pops that I wanted to open up and show you guys in this video. But yeah, guys, we've reached the end of the video. Hopefully you did enjoy. If you did, be sure to leave a like, comment, and subscribe, and I will see you next time. Bye!